Welcome back to CrossFit RVA and we're Richmond, Virginia. I'm Jackie, this is Brandon. We're gonna be doing episode 24. We're gonna talk about improving your pistols. All right, so we're gonna talk about the three problems that people typically have with a pistol, starting with strength, and then we're gonna work on to balance and ankle mobility. So first thing is strength. We're gonna do a progression using a band. So you set this up on pull-up rig using the J-hooks. You wanna start with a thicker band and obviously as you progress going to thinner and thinner bands. So you wanna set it up at a height where it's about at the top of your hamstring. And so obviously you can see it's top of Brandon's hamstring. He's gonna demonstrate doing a pistol with the band. So as he comes down, the band is helping him stand up. It's just using assistance to help him stand up out of the pistol. So if you struggle standing up out of a pistol, obviously you'll use a band. And you wanna work down to thinner and thinner bands as you get stronger. All right, next we're gonna talk about balance. So we have a couple of things that you can work on for this. So one of them is a leaning to the side while you're doing your pistol. So Brandon's gonna demonstrate just doing a straight up and down pistol, and then we'll do the lean. So just straight up and down, not leaning one to one side or the other, but now he's gonna do one where he's leaning towards the side where he's actually squatting. So he's gonna lean on his right leg as he's doing the squat. And this helps as a counterbalance. Um, if you're doing a pistol, some people have issues with balance, so this is a good way to counterbalance your leg. Another progression is doing what I like to call like a half circle squat. So he's gonna demonstrate just doing a regular pistol up and down without leading to the circle. And then he's gonna do a pistol where he leads with his hips. So he's gonna do a regular pistol and then leading back up with his hips, kind of creating that half circle motion. So do one more. He's leaning with his hips and this can help as well with your balance. A progression from that, if you aren't able to do a pistol that way, is using the rack. So he's gonna hold on to the rig as he's doing the pistol, going down, and then again, leading with his hips. All right, the last thing we're gonna go over is ankle mobility, which I think is probably the most important thing and the thing that most people struggle with the most. So the first thing we're gonna do is a banded stretch. So Brandon is going to take a band, likely a thin band, and wrap it around his foot, double wrap it, so as you can see, twice around the, ankle, around the foot, around your midfoot for this, and then he's going to raise it up and flex his foot as well as point, and then do an inversion and an eversion, and then circles. So you're gonna use also the band to kind of pull your foot back and also guide your foot through the stretch, and you're gonna do about 10 to 15 of each of these movements before a workout. Another stretch we're gonna do for ankle mobility is a wall stretch. And you can do this also on a rig, it doesn't matter. But you're gonna put one foot in front, keep it flat, and then keep your heel down, and then push your knee towards the wall or the rig, emphasizing your flat heel, and then pausing and bringing it back to normal, doing about 10 to 15 of these as well. Thanks for watching episode 24 about improving your pistols. I'm Jackie, this is Brandon. Tune in next time by subscribing to the Cityscape. See, that was so much better.